to move through or expand item. Hi, it's Dr. Robinson, and today I'm going to go over how you use the new Google Drive updates. You do not need to control shift F and go to your settings to enable it because it automatically enabled in August. Uh, a lot of people are having huge challenges with this. So we have three browsers, Firefox, Chrome, and Edge. I'm going to tell you to use Firefox. Chrome and Edge are riddled with issues and you've got to use a lot of tricks to get it working and why do the frustration. So use Firefox for now until they uh, fix whatever they need to fix. So the first thing I'm going to do is, um, and I'm going to tell you, Control F6 is really nice. I'm recording right now, so unfortunately Control F6 has an issue uh, with my drive because it also shares uh, with Zoom, so I cannot do it. But uh, the easiest way is Control F6. Make sure your cursor is off. And I'm going to tell you it pops back on when you're navigating. You're immediately going to know it's not working because you can't do what you wanted to do. Um, and just insert Z with JAWS, of course, caps lock space with NVDA. Get that cursor off and life is going to become a lot better. Okay, so I'm going to jump to my list view because the list view is the biggest issue. I'm going to Alt-G and then I. Alt-G. I quick find edit Denise Cheryl zip type and text okay. computer braille and you heard it. frame main region one columns and three rows not selected Denise Cheryl okay. zip compressed archive home. I'm gonna hush him up because you heard all your content that you needed which does not read in Edge or Chrome I'm gonna down arrow me of 26 20 more actions all day button menu collapsed as pop up menu okay. I could already tell you my cursor popped on because down arrow should lead me right down that list. So insert Z. Off. Okay, and down arrow. A reader human wear a circuit F10 final 0623202. I'm going to hush them up. Down arrow again. Inverse matrix PDF. And you can see the list works beautifully. Once again, as soon as you down arrow, you're actually moving across the row, as you probably already know, to me, to the date, etc. As soon as you start doing that, just know your cursor pops. Popped on. Get it off again. Okay, up arrow. A reader human wear a circuit F10 final 06. Denise Cheryl. Zip okay. compressed archival. Now, I'm going to tab across my row. More actions toolbar. Share control all day button menu. Call one row one. What's nice is as I tab, it's telling me the command. Now, it's a toolbar, so right arrow. Download button menu. Rename control all day button menu. Add the start control all day button menu. Okay. When you cannot write arrow anymore, then you tab again. More actions, all day button menu. Press space to activate the menu, then navigate with arrow keys. Okay, we already know all A, it used to be A for actions. All A opens all these options right in the list view. So you do not need to tab to this, but I just want to show you it's there. I'm going to hit space bar and open. Space, menu loading, menu loading, context, menu as pop-up, open with menu, sub menu, one of eight. Okay, it's going to give me an open with because this was a zip file, so I could right arrow and I could go down and extract it here if I want to. I do not, I want to down arrow, just listen to your options. Download menu, rename, control, make a copy, can share menu, sub menu, organize menu, sub file information, move the trash, delete menu. Eight. Okay, so we already have a lot of commands for that, but you know, as you're learning the new commands, this is really handy. But once again, you do not need to tab all the way here. You can do all A right on the list of folder. I'm going to hit escape and get out and go back. Escape, leaving menu. Main region. Okay, I'm going to shift tab. If I tab forward, I'm going to shift tab back. More actions toolbar. Share Denise Cheryl. Zip okay. press start. Let's go down and a reader human wear a circuit of 10 five. Okay, and now once you upload into Google, it's gonna open in docs. I'm gonna hit enter on this and it's automatically going to open for me. Enter document read only working. A reader human wear a circuit of 10 final 0623202201. Docs, Google Docs, Mozilla, Firefox. I'm going to hush him up. Now, what is so essential when you get into Docs is make sure your Braille view is enabled. I don't care if you do not use a Braille, <laughs> Braille display. If you just use a screen reader, you still have to enable it. It's control all N, but I'm going to do alt slash because if you forget a command, alt slash will immediately take you to your search and you can type 
anything in there. Alt slash. Alt slash menu bar banner region. Search the menus. Alt. Okay, I'm gonna hush him up. I'm gonna R and A I L L E. Enable Braille support. Control Alt H checked. One of three. Enable Braille support. I've already enabled that because guess what? Your documents will not work, or anything Google will not work without Control Alt H. Once again, if your Control Alt H is having a fit, no big deal. Alt slash. Type in anything you need here and it will work. Now, uh, your screen reader is liable to tell you control alt Z. That's also, you need to enable your accessibility. Uh, and of course, that's what my screen reader immediately told me when I was there. So that is just a heads up on that. Let's go ahead and go back. I'm going to control W and close. Control W, main region, one columns and three rows. A reader human wear a circuit F10, final 0623202020. I'm going to hush them up. I know I'm in my list view still. I'm going to down arrow. Inverse matrix, PDF, PDF owned by me, last modified by me. I'm going to hush them up. Once again, if that did not read and it started to move along the row, insert Z. For whatever reason, it decided to be really good and it decided to keep my cursor off. Once again, this is technology. Okay, let's get to our navigation. Alt G N. Alt G N. Folders and views tree view. Home. To move through or expand items, use the arrow keys. Beautiful. Let's down arrow. My drive closed. Select computers closed. Shared with me. Recent. Start. Spam. Trash. Storage. I'm going to go back up arrow and I'm going to show you another trick. Because every once in a while, the list view gets kind of cranky and you're trying to get there and it doesn't allow you to get there. And I laugh. You guys all get this. Good grief. You've used technology. We're so used to things just not working and you just got to laugh. Otherwise, you're going to cry. Anyway, I'm going to up arrow back to my drive. Crash. Snap. Start. Recent. Share. Compute. My drive closed. Selected. Okay, I'm going to hit enter on that. Enter. My drive. Google Drive. More actions. All day. Button. Menu. Collapsed. Task. Pop-up. Menu. See shortcuts. Main region. One columns and three rows. Not selected. Denise Cheryl. Zip. And you'll archive. notice it automatically popped me back to my list view. It read the list view beautifully. Now, I'm about 99% sure my cursor popped back on. Let's down arrow and see if we're moving across the row or down the list. A reader human wear a circuit oh. of 10 final zero six. Looky there, it decided to stay off. Once again, if it starts moving across your row, don't do that. Okay, let's do an Alt A. We already know that's the command, Alt A to. Alt A, context menu has pop up, menu loading, open with menu, yep. sub menu, one of eight. To move through items, press up or down arrow. So it loads our actions. We know this. We can down arrow. Download, me, rename, make a share, me, organize, file in, move to trash, delete. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Hit escape. Escape, leaving Hit menu, out. main region, escape, unselected. Okay, let's go up to our new button, Alt N. Alt N, menu, leaving menus, new, new folder, Alt C, N, F button, menu, press space to activate the menu, then navigate with arrow yep. keys. And I'm going to tell you this works flawlessly. Also, uh, and of course, in the meantime of your memorizing Alt C then F, uh, you can just Alt N and of course down arrow and listen. Menu file upload Alt C folder upload Alt C Google Docs menu sub Google Sheets menu sub Google Slide Google more menu sub and more very easy it is escape. escape leaving menus new a slash of course we always need that in order for our search slash banner region search region search and drive you. Uh, U. Wrong letter. I I N V E R S. Okay, so I'm starting to type in inverse because I know inverse matrix is someplace here. I could hit enter right now and it popped me in my list view, but I also know it works much better if I just down arrow. Blank, blank, list box, open PDF inverse matrix, PDF OG 13 yep. year verbal beat. And that's what I want to do, so I'm hitting enter on enter. that. Showing viewer dialogue page displaying inverse matrix. PDF. Okay. Now, we could go into another really cool lesson on actually taking this image of work and putting it through mathkicker.a and it having it come out perfect now. We just love that. If you have not watched those videos yet, I highly suggest you go to our YouTube channel, uh, yourtechvision.com, and actually the search would be at Dr. Denise M. Robinson Tech. You will find our channel and uh, you can go to all things technology and get any answer that you need. And if you can't find it, let me know and I'll do another video on that. I'm gonna hit escape and get out. Escape, search and drive, edit as pop-up. Okay, so that is how you navigate drive for now. 
when they fix, uh, as in Google, when they go ahead and fix uh, Edge and uh, Chrome, and I'm actually not sure it's a Google issue. I think it's a browser issue because it works flawlessly in Firefox. Um, because I've heard a lot of people say, oh, it's a Google issue. And Google's probably saying, no, it's not. It works great in Firefox. And as you see, it really, really does. So you can navigate in uh, Firefox in Google Drive flawlessly. And that's how you do that. Okay, please let me know if you have any more questions. And we'll see you in the next video. Context menu.